Hey, y'all. Let's see in the questions. Somebody said, how do you deal with feeling overwhelmed? Oh, this is a good question. How do I deal with feeling overwhelmed? I call my sister or I call my brother. And I just, first of all, I don't know about y'all, but I'm one of those people, I have to take a moment. But I think what makes me feel the most um, centered and better about myself is I'll say, you know what? Every day is not going to be perfect, and that's okay. You're here with yourself. The fact that you have food and water and you're in this beautiful house, the fact that you have clothes and a family that loves you, like these are all blessings and things that we take for granted. Like, so whatever I'm feeling, too overwhelmed like girl look around look at your life god has blessed you so i just have to remind myself if i can't remind myself i call my sister and she reminds me and um or my brother reminds me like i just have to sometimes i need to hear it from someone else and then i feel better the next day anyways next question um, what is a goal you would love to accomplish oh what a great question I think, oh, I have so many goals. I think one of the main goals for myself is to believe in myself more and to gain more confidence in myself. I feel like I have so much belief and so much confidence in the people that I love and the people that I care for. I just see so much light and potential in so many people. And I'm just like, you are so amazing. And I have to... I have to be able to look at myself in the mirror and say that as well. And I do. I'm like, yeah, you're great. You're doing good. I have to be able to remind myself like, no, you're really doing it. You're really doing it. I have to look myself in the mirror and remind myself of that. And it's interesting because I always, this is how I know I'm like, I feel like God is always guiding my life because in every role that I take and every step that I take it like matches up with the phase that I'm in with my life somebody said will you ever take out your hair your dreads your locks you know I talk about this all the time I think that I would as of now that's how I feel but let me tell you why because Okay, so I've had my locks since I was five years old. My mom locked my hair when I was younger. And I don't really have any memories of myself with my um, loose hair out. I just remember having locks all my life. And so I love my hair. I love my locks. But I always have just been so curious as to, okay, what would my loose hair be like would I look cool with the afro would I look different what would it be like so I always have this curiosity what's up everyone welcome to today's commentary guys that was Holly Bailey answering questions from her fans and in case some of you don't know who she really is Holly Bailey is a great actress and a great singer and a lot of people really love what she do now she rose to fame along with her sister Chloe after posting music videos that went viral guys Holly Bailey is 24 years old she has achieved quite a lot because just this year she received a Grammy nomination for her song Angel guys she has a huge social media following and a lot of people look up to her Holly has also been featured in various movies and TV shows for instance Gronish, The Little Mermaid, The Color Purple among others no guys, apart from her career life, Holly Bailey has a child with DDG and their son's name is Halo and was born in December of 2023. Now, on October 3rd this year, DDG announced that himself together with Holly Bailey have gone their separate ways. 
Guys, DDG revealed that that decision was not even easy to make, but they believed it was the best path forward for both of them. Now, the two are just uh, focused on, you know, uh, raising their son, and I wish them the very best. You anyway, guys, back to the video you just watched. I loved how Holly Bailey answered every question that she was asked by her fans. For instance, when she said that whenever she feels overwhelmed you know she calls her sister chloe bailey and her brother that just made me realize that you know her siblings love her so much and guys we have to admit that chloe bailey is a good big sister chloe is so supportive of Haley, and you all know that chloe also love halo so 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 much you know uh Hallie also said that whenever she's feeling overwhelmed, you know, she looks at how much God has blessed her. You know, guys, sometimes in life, we take a lot of things for granted. For instance, good health, food, water, clothes. Those are things that, you know, we should actually thank God for. And those are things that should actually motivate us to keep moving. And I just don't know what you all think about uh, that, but go ahead in the comment section and tell me. Also, guys, may God fulfill Holly Bailey's desires because she said that one of her goals is to make sure that she believes in herself more. Honestly, guys, Holly Bailey has a lot of potential. And uh, honestly, uh, you all know that it's very important to believe in yourself. It's very important to have confidence in yourself. Guys, when she talked about her looks, I remembered how I love it when she styles them differently. For instance, when she's attending events. That's all for now. Thank you very much, guys, for watching the video and for always supporting me. I don't take your support for granted at all. May God bless you. And lastly, guys, please hit the subscribe button. You're on the road to 20,000 subscribers and I'll really, really appreciate your support. Bye. Let's meet in the next one.